Good morning and welcome to this time of prayer together. My name is Joyce and this morning's prayer comes from St Mary, Star of the Sea, Meath, Edinburgh. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. We pray, Almighty and everlasting God, you have given the human race, Jesus Christ, our Saviour, as a model of humility. He fulfilled your will by becoming man and giving his life on the cross. Help us to bear witness to you by following his example of suffering and make us worthy to share his resurrection. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son. Our reading today from Holy Scripture is from the letter of St Paul to the Romans. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, by faith, we are judged righteous and at peace with God, since it is by faith and through Jesus that we have entered this state of grace, in which we can boast about looking forward to God's glory. And this hope is not deceptive, because the love of God has been poured into our hearts by the Holy Spirit, which has been given us. We were still helpless when at his appointed moment, Christ died for sinful men. It is not easy to die even for a good man, though of course, for someone really worthy, a man might be prepared to die. But what proves that God loves us is that Christ died for us while we were still sinners. The word of the Lord. In this chapter, we hear about wonderful gifts that we have all been given us through the Holy Spirit. Faith, peace, grace, love and hope. The love of God has been poured into our hearts by the Holy Spirit. If we had been given only one of these gifts, it would be enough for us to live by. Hope for me is Christ's love for all of us and he died while we were still sinners. A quote from St. John Henry Newman. Be courageous and generous and give your heart and you will never repent of the sacrifice. Be courageous and generous and give your heart and you will never repent of the service. Now as we bring our time of prayer to a close, let us pray together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Dear friends, thank you for joining us in this morning's prayer, wishing you a good day in all that you do. Thank you.